The Pembroke Welsh Corgi is an active and intelligent herding dog and affectionate, eager to please and sweet companion. There are top 10 interesting facts about the Pembroke Welsh Corgi. Number 1. Origin the exact date of origin and exact ancestry of the Pembroke Welsh Corgi is not certainly clear. It's definitely an old dog breed and their history possibly dates back to the 10th century when Vikings brought Swedish Walhund to Wales and from those dogs the Pembroke Welsh Corgi was developed. Another theory suggests that they are descendants of various dogs like Skipper Key, Keyshunt or Pomeranian brought to Wales by Flemish weavers in the 12th century. Number 2. Legend The history of Pembroke Welsh Corgi is surrounded by mystery, and there are even legends and fairy tales about them. One of them say that one day two children found a couple of Pembroke Welsh Corgi puppies in the forest. First, they think they are little foxes, but they took them home and their parents recognized little dogs and told their children that the pups were a gift from the fairies that lived in the forest. They also told the kids that they were used to pull carriages for fairies and as a proof they pointed to the marks on their backs where the fairy saddle had been placed on their shoulders. Number 3. Herding Dogs the Pembroke Welsh Corgi looks sweet and cute, so many people think that they are the typical companion lab dogs, but that cannot be far from the truth. These dogs have been used as a herding dogs for centuries. They are probably the smallest of all herding dogs, but they are great at it. They are pretty fast, determined, intelligent and hard working, which are great qualities for herding. Number 4. Name the Pembroke Welsh Corgi has an interesting name. The Pembroke Welsh is describing the place of origin in Pembrokeshire, Wales. But what about the word Corgi? There are explanation and translations. The first one is from Celtic, where the word Corgi means dog. Or it can be a combination of Welsh words Cor and Gi. Cor means dwarf and Gi means dog. So Corgi most likely means dwarf dog, which fits perfectly. Number 5. Cardigan vs Pembroke Even though very similar, the Cardigan and Pembroke Welsh Corgi are two separated breeds and there are some important differences between them. The most famous is the tail, even though it's not that obvious, because most Pembroke Welsh Corgis are either born without a tail or their tail is docked close to the body while the Cardigan has pretty long tail. But today, especially in the regions where docking is illegal, many Pembrokes have long tail. It's not really that unusual for Pembroke Welsh Corgi to have long tail. Tail. But there are other differences as well. The Pembroke has a shorter body and his ears are pointed, while the cardigans are more rounded at the tips. Number 6. Royalty This breed gained a lot of popularity in 1930s when the King Charles VI gifted one of these pups to his daughters Elizabeth and Margaret. Queen Elizabeth II was probably the biggest corgi lover in history of the royal family and she owned more than 30 of them during her life. There is also a movie called The Queen's Corgi, released in 2019. Number 7. Exercise Just like all the herding dog breeds, even the Pembroke Welsh Corgi is pretty active dog. Their short legs make us think that they are slow, but if they are healthy, they can reach speed up to 25 miles per hour, which is 40 kilometers per hour. Thanks to that, they are great at various dog sports like agility, flyball or of course herding events. They definitely need daily longer walks and some interactive playtime that will occupy their mind to stay healthy and happy. Number 8. Size The Pembroke Welsh Corgi is famous for their short legs and stature, prick ears and overall foxy appearance. Their average height is between 10 to 12 inches, which is 25 to 30 centimeters, and weight is typically between 24 to 31 pounds, which is 11 to 14 kilograms. There are not big size differences between males and females. Number 9. Watchdog the Pembroke Welsh Corgi was not only used as herding dog, they were also used as all around farm dogs and they were even watching over the farms. And they are excellent watchdogs. It is mostly thanks to their alert nature and well they just love to bark. You can count on your Corgi to start alarm barking when he will hear or see something suspicious around the house. Number 10. Health 
The Pembroke Welsh Corgi has an average lifespan between 12 to 15 years. This is a chondroplastic breed, which means that they are true dwarfs, they have dwarfism. There are some health issues associated with this breed, for example hip dysplasia, von Willebrand's disease, degenerative myelopathy and progressive retinal atrophy. Tell me in comments what you like the most about the Pembroke Welsh Corgi and what is your experience with this dog breed. If you are new on this channel, consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check our Instagram, Facebook links are in description. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.